The only thing that I could hear was the drum of, of our fans. It's a red card for David Beckham. He's kicked out and now he's out of the game. Yeah, it was it was pretty lonely in the in the change room. It was a lonely uh, 20 minutes. I knew that obviously I wouldn't play in the next game, but I didn't care about that. I just wanted the team to win. What an awful time to receive a red card in this crucial game. Get your head down, work hard. That's all you can do. I think it all started from the first game in the World Cup, really. So I think going into a game like this, we always knew that there was something special about playing Argentina. It was intense. You read everything that the fans are saying, the excitement back home. So we knew that it was a massive game. There was always a chance that one of the players was going to react. You know, it just happens in football. Um, unfortunately, it was me. The question marks have been raised over his temperament and one wonders as he goes down the tunnel if he takes his country's World Cup hopes with him. It was hostile, you know, when I arrived back in England. But um, I think when you go through something like that, you start, you know, doubting yourself in, in some ways, no matter how much support you have. You know, it was one of those things that happened that obviously I wish that it never happened. Um, I wish that I'd never gone through and my family had gone through what we went through after you know, after that World Cup for the next four years, but my playing, you know, I never, I never changed anything because I didn't need to. I knew that I, that I had to work hard to be successful and to be, to be the best I could possibly be. You have to have confidence in yourself and your ability. Um, and I'm more confident on the field than I am off the field. Um, you know, I think that that's the biggest thing for me. I always felt safer as a, as a person on the field than off the field. Four years on, obviously playing Argentina again. We were playing really well in the World Cup um, and we played well in that game. But there was an intense atmosphere because it was in a dome, the, the fans were incredible. And then obviously getting the penalty. David Beckham will take the responsibility. I knew that it was up to me. Everything kind of flashed back to four years before. I just knew that I had to hit it true and hit it hard and, and hope for the best. It's there! He's done it! His redemption is complete! That was a huge moment for me personally. It was the real moment where it kind of wiped everything away for me. You know, who knows, I might not have had the career that I had, um, you know, if it hadn't have happened. My advice to any player that would go through something like that would be to get your head down and work hard. That's all you can do. One thing that I learned from my dad was, you know, when you're going through a difficult time, put your head down and work. Simple as that. It's a special boot. Colourway's perfect. I wish I was still playing. Am I allowed to take them though? My kids would love these. Come on, you can't say you can't say no to like kids. <laughs>